Hey guys, welcome to another Mr. Mutech video. Today I'm going to show you how to fix your AccuWeather app if you're having issues. That could be just simply opening the app, the app crashing, or other things just not operating as normal. Maybe you're having some uh, freezing up or the app is kind of buggy. I'm gonna show you some things that you can do to potentially fix that problem today. So the first thing that you're gonna to wanna to do is go ahead and go to settings on your iPhone device. And once you go to settings, you are going to notice that you have an option here for that specific app. Just gonna scroll all the way down until we get to that actual app. So here's AccuWeather. We're gonna go ahead and tap on AccuWeather. A couple things we're gonna to wanna to make sure of is that the background app refresh is on. You may wanna just go ahead and toggle that to off for a few seconds, turn it back on. Also, you wanna make sure that cellular data is available. So if you are not connected to Wi-Fi and this is not on, then the app is not going to work properly. The other thing that you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and look at is the location, because if you're noticing that the location is just not working properly on this app, then you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you have the location setting on. And right now you can see this is set to never. We're gonna to wanna to go ahead and turn this on. We can have it on just while we're using the app if we just don't want it to be draining our location uh, or, or tracking our location and draining our battery all the time. So you don't have to always have it on. You could just have it while using the app. But if you do want to have notifications and stuff like that for severe weather, you may just want to have this set to always. And then obviously you want to have precise location on as well. That needs to be toggled so that I can know your exact location to give you updates on the weather. Okay, so if you have checked and this has corrected the problem, that's great. If not, there are some other things that we can do. So I'm gonna go ahead and show those to you now. We're gonna go ahead and back out of this. And then we're gonna go ahead and go back to our main settings page. And we're going to go to general next. And then after we go to general, general we're gonna to go to iPhone storage. And you're going to just go ahead and tap on the search bar here if you have a lot of apps. And then you could search for AccuWeather minus the first one here. I'm gonna just go ahead and tap on that. And this is like a last ditch effort. If you have tried everything and you're still having problems, you're probably gonna to wanna to offload the app. Now, this doesn't make you sign back up for the app or anything. It will just go ahead and temporarily delete the app on your iPhone, but saves all the data and everything as well so it can just get restarted again easily. So go ahead and tap on offload app. You're gonna notice that it's offloaded and then you have an option here to just simply tap and, and reinstall the app. And once that gets reinstalled, hopefully things are smoothed over for you. Like I said, this is a last stitch effort if the other things didn't work for you. Hopefully this was helpful for you guys. And if so, I'd really appreciate a like on this video or a thumbs up rather. Have a great day. Take care, everyone.